gauged it. You know, I, I couldn't even tell you, honestly, God, I couldn't tell you what our record is. You know, I just stay focused on uh, uh, what we need to do today to get better and to win our next hockey game. And, uh, you know, maybe I'm, you know, I thought I was pretty good in math. Maybe I'm not a numbers guy, but, you know, for me, that's my way of just staying locked in is not paying any attention to that stuff. And, um, you know, at the end of the season, I, I look back and say what it means to be a coach. I mean, you, you have time to, to reflect with your, your upperclassmen and, you uh, you, know, you hope you're you hope you're looking back uh, yeah, with a lot of pride that way. You know, and uh, it's funny when those rush were talking at the end. It felt like they were talking for a couple hours. There was only a couple seconds to figure it out, but we just wanted to drop the puck and get the game going. And as soon as we saw those seconds count down and we got it out of our blue line, it just everything kind of clicked and jumped jumped out. As as the video show, we were we were fired up. That's that's what we feel. He's been great all year, um, and it means a lot especially as defensemen, to have a goalie back there that, that you can trust because it allows you to play out, it allows you to pressure guys in the defensive zone and, and play with confidence, knowing that you have a goaltender back there who, who's going to at least make the first save. And uh, we just got to be there to, to clear the guys out, um, clean, clean pucks out. So, yeah, it, it's, it's been great having a guy back there like that. We switched conferences last year driving seven hours to different places we've never really played before. We never succeed in that way. It's not something we really think about. Uh, we're more just focused on starting the way we want to and then just getting the job done. Uh, Alec Robitaille scoring uh, the, the game winner here. I mean, he's, he's, a, he's an awesome young man and uh, he's you know, throwing some curve balls with injuries uh, that have made it tough for him. Uh, to get back in the lineup after being in the lineup and you know he stayed the court course he's a loyal dog and a, and a quality teammate and uh, um, you know that, that was a good moment for me you know good guys get their due if they stay the course.